All the sellers out there, Rob Lukey, Shop Prop, I'm going to tell you something that no other agent is going to tell you, and that is that it has little to do with the agent. It has a lot to do with price, product, and timing. I can prove that to you empirically over and over again. I'm going to start off with this particular listing. This is a listing that we had listed first in June of 2021. We had this property listed for sale. Didn't sell. Market obviously started to get it. It was a little bit weak during that time. This was high at that time. We had just actually sold the highest price ever recorded in this community, which is one of the reasons why the sellers went, went with us. We did have offers on the property, but again, nothing that the seller wanted to take. So they went ahead and canceled. When they relisted, they ended up paying a mass, a lot more money. And guess who represented the buyers? We did. This happens time and time again at Shop Prop. They, we, they end up, somebody cancels because the timing changed or something occurred. And then we end up representing the buyer on it over and over again. Case in point right here, like I said, we represented the buyer because they went ahead and moved to somebody else. Now we have smart buyers, we have smart sellers as well. Let me show you two examples of smart sellers recently that went ahead and lit, relisted with us. So here's a property that was listed last year. Now it was listed actually with somebody else and it didn't sell. They, I'm sure they did a great job. It was listed with Kel Keller Williams. Are we a better broker than them? Because we now have it, we listed it this year and we were able to get it listed and sold in five days and it sold well over the listing price. Uh, I'm talking $100,000 over the list price. I would say, no, the other, the other agent probably did a good job. We charge a fraction of what these other agents charge and yet they, we get the same or better results. Here's another smart uh, seller and this just happened. Here's another smart seller. This is in Napa. Here's a, here's a client that went ahead again and listed with us last year. We had this property on the market for 53 days. It didn't sell. Guess what? We listed the property this year, the price, product. What changed though? Timing. The market's better than it was at the end of last year. We went pending on this thing. We had three offers on the property, went pending in five days. Again, list at list price. So here we are at, at with three examples that show you empirically it has to do with timing, price, and product. Please understand, sellers, that regardless of what agent you're with, that's the reality of it. Unless you have an agent that is completely incompetent and doesn't get back to people or doesn't understand contracts or your property isn't marketed correctly. And when I say marketed correctly, simply put in the MLS with good pictures is marketed correctly. Don't believe all the other hype that's out there. Majority of buyers, and I say the majority, 98% of buyers, this is per California Association of Realtors report last year, 98% of their buyers start their search online on a website, which means that if you put your property in the MLS, it's going to go out to every single site that's out there. I hope you, I hope that helps. Again, something that other agents aren't going to tell you, that it has little to do with the agent that has your property that listed. It has to do with product, that's your home, price, and timing. I hope that helps.